Arms up, breathe in, and breathe out, and hands come down to heart center. Arms up, breathe in, and breathe out. One more deep breath in, and breathe out. Arms up, lean forward, four fold. Bend the knees, breathe in and out, breathe in and out. One more deep breath in. Now step back and go to your knees. Breathe in, we're gonna do cat cow. Breathe in, look up. Breathe out, look for the belly button. Pull the abs in, breathe in, look up, breathe out. Pull those abs in. One more deep breath in. And breathe out. Now from here, go to tabletop. And just kind of move your hips side to side, loosening up the lower back. Breathing in and out, keeping the abs pulled in. Come back to the center. Lean back for child's pose. Breathe in and out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, come up some and then go down into a space pose, right? Or you can call it a lioness or lion or whatever you want to call it. Breathe in and out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, we're going to do Advasana, which is basically reverse Advasana way down. Breathe in and out. Now, you can lay on your hands or you can have your forehead on your hands or on the floor. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, come back up to your tabletop. Making sure your knees, shoulder, elbow, wrists are aligned. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. One more deep breath in. From here, take your left foot, move it forward, and go into a low lunge. Make sure your knee and ankle are aligned. You might need to move back your right knee some on the mat, and you can come up, breathing in, and out, or maybe keep your hands down, breathe in and out, maybe hands on the thigh. Breathe in and out, stay focused. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, come back down, take that uh, left foot, move it back towards the right. And any way you can, now take the right foot, move it forward, and then go into your low lunge or run a stretch, and hands can go up, or they can stay down, up to you. Breathing in and out. Continue to breathe in and out, and gravity is going to pull you closer to the mat. Breathe in and out. One more deep breath in, and now come down as you breathe out and take that foot and move it back. Now maybe you go like one at a time here or wherever is best for you. Breathe in in your tabletop and breathe out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, sit on the floor. We're gonna butterfly our legs out. And you can have your legs as far as close to your body as you would like. I like to hold on to my ankles down here and let the knees fly, fly out, right? Now, one of my 
legs is tighter than the other. Well, my, one of my hips is tighter than the other. Now, if you want, you can kind of rock side to side if you like. Some of you are a little bit more flexible. Maybe you put your elbows on your knees and press them down some. But breathe in and out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, take your left foot and straighten it out to the side and your right foot can stay right where it is or if you have the space, you can bring it in even more. Lean over to your left, feeling that stress or sensation go down the, uh, excuse me, yeah, down the body, breathing in and out. If it's too much, come out. One more deep breath in through the nose. Breathe out through the mouth and hands come up. Breathe in. As you breathe out, lean forward, keeping the, the glutes on the floor. Right? So come down as far as you can. Maybe put your hands on the floor. Bend those elbows and feel that stress or sensation in the left thigh. One more deep breath in. Now come up as you breathe out. Let's switch legs. I can't see how much time we get left. Oh, we got more time. All right, legs out. This foot is in. Toe is up, breathe in. Arms go up, breathe out and lean over to your right. Feeling that stretch go down the side of the body. Excuse me. breath in. As you breathe out, arms come up. Breathe in. As you breathe out, lean forward. Right? And the butt stays on the floor. And go down as far as you can. Breathing in and out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, sit back up. Straighten out your left leg. Now both legs are out. And arms up. And walk it forward. As go down as far as you can, keeping your back as flat as possible. Don't hunch over like this. Just keep up straight. You can bend the elbows to go down further. Some of you, you're, you have great flexibility, so maybe you're all the way on the floor. But go down as far as you can, breathing in and out. One more deep breath in. As you breathe out, walk your hands back. Great job. All right, we're gonna sit with our legs crossed, or you can sit with your legs straight if you'd like. We are going to go ahead and take the rest of our time to meditate. So I want you to start by slowly breathing in through the nose and exhaling through the mouth. Breathe in and out. Now continue to stay focused on the breath. And this is a perfect time for you to pray it's a perfect time to uh, think about the things you're grateful and thankful for. You can say them out loud. Also a perfect time to love on oneself by telling yourself, you know, the different things you love about yourself. It doesn't have to always be body. It can be anything. Continue to breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. If your mind begins to wander, come back to our session here through prayer or your grateful, thankful list. Just calming the nervous system. Many of us went back to work this week, so practice your breathing at work. Take deep breaths in and out. It will help to calm your nervous system, especially if you're working on a project or you have a deadline to meet or people are just stressing you out.
One more deep breath in. Keep pushing on.